Hey, welcome to another Windows 7 video and this is a little video uh, showing you that uh, if you have problems with your Windows 7 install, something's wrong, maybe um, a part of um, your computer isn't working well, uh, maybe a device, maybe something in Windows itself, uh, maybe you don't have any internet, doesn't work, um, all sorts of little problems. Uh, there's a tool in Windows 7 that actually can check your PC and troubleshoot what you need to do. So um, if you want to have that simple, because it is really a simple, really simple task, but it does exist. Um, it doesn't fix really big problems, but it does fix problems and it's worth trying before calling the tech guy, for example. And so what you want to do is actually go into the start menu at the bottom left. Go in your control panel. If your uh, control panel is in icon view, click on the upper right in the icon, large or small icons, and go click categories so that you're in the category section. On the left, go where it says system and security and go click find and fix problems and in that panel you will see at the bottom run maintenance tasks now this is what you want to do the system maintenance will clean up files shortcuts and also look at what's wrong with your computer so you can actually click the next button and letting the computer go and try to fix stuff. Uh, keep in mind, as you see here, you need to be administrator to have all the permissions to uh, have this function working. So um, you do have to go into your admin, admin account. So it uh, performs uh, diverse little things. It cleans and erases some lost files that are um, unnecessary and um, there are of course additional options available that you can click that will um, help here it uh, will bring you to the help and support for example at the top and um, you can also ch click the find related troubleshooters and so um, it's very simple it doesn't do that much but if you have a problem it's worth going into that little maintenance tool in Windows 7 to see if everything is okay another little tool that you can use is if your problems are um, related to performance you can also check what it says here for perf performance issues and this will check and detect what types of programs are going in startup and see what you can improve and you see here start system configuration will show you what's starting up with your computer it's uh, quite handy both of these little tools will help you see why your computer might be slow or just not working very well so um, it's very very interesting you can also click next and see what else there is um, of a problem with your computer it will show up in that little window there and tell you oh well you've got a problem with this or that or maybe a device is not working well so uh, I think it's something that is uh, worth going into and of course it can also fix Windows update problems so it's here is here fix problems with Windows update all you have to do is go there and check what types of problems you have if you've seen for example, that every time you close your computer, there's a, a um, update or maybe multiple updates that try to install, but every time you close down and you restart, they're always there and they always want to be installed. Um, there might be a problem with the Windows updates. So uh, clicking Windows Update to resolve problems and clicking Next will bring you the Windows Update tool to fix some of those problems. So that's basically a nice little panel to go for troubleshooting simple problems. But um, even though it doesn't fix problems that are very complex, 
a lot of the small little problems and details that we have in Windows 7 every day will actually be fixed by this. So it's pretty cool for that. So if you enjoy Windows 7 or like to learn more about Windows 7, click the subscribe button at the top of the screen. You'll be informed of all the videos we put online. And if you have any comments or questions, hey, let us know. Maybe you have a request of a video about something you'd like to know on in Windows 7. Uh, hey, let us know. We'll try to put a video online for you. So thanks for watching and hope you come back to the uh, Learn Windows 7 channel. Bye-bye.